I'm recontemplating life at the moment. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tiaja. If you're new here and if you're returning, thanks for coming back. As y'all can see, we are in the car. So if I'm in the car, you know I'm going somewhere. It is June 28th. I leave for my trip July 3rd, so you know what that means. It's time to prep. It's time to get everything done because time is ticking. Time is dwindling down. So, I just got off work. I had to go home and change my clothes. And I need to return these packages that's been sitting in my house for about a good week and a half. So... I'm gonna go do that. My first stop to do is to go to the bank, get some cash out because these automatic drives are trying to play me. I unlocked my card last night and somehow, some shape, some form, transactions is still coming out and my trip money is in here. They done took $200 from me. I don't like that. So, it's giving, we about to take the rest of this cash out and just spend cash for whatever, whatever I have to buy and then put it back on my car before I leave because I don't have time for the shenanigans right now. So yeah, um, after I do that, I'm going to go pick up Bree because we are about to go to Target to get our toiletries. It's why you can't go to Target with Brie. What we coming here for, Brie? What we coming here for? What did we come in here for? Toiletries. Toiletries and we got two piece sets in our cart. I'm vlogging. Uh -oh. <laughs> As you can tell by the looks of my hair, I am on my way to get my hair done. I was supposed to be up this morning at five o'clock to wash my hair, blow dry, and I didn't get up to six o'clock. So we're a little behind schedule. I was supposed to be there at eight this morning. It's giving 8.30. Not too bad, but I am getting knotless boho braids. A typical black girl trip hairstyle, but I'm trying color this time. I had color before, maybe two, three years ago, but I feel like this color is gonna be a little lighter, so I'm a little nervous. Um, hopefully everything goes okay. Hopefully they can mix the hair I wanted. I bought my own boho hair because when they did my hair the last time for my Jamaican trip, the boho hair was okay. I could tell it was more of like a human synthetic blend and not all human so i was like okay if i'm going back to this hair salon i need to buy my own boho hair because we're not about to deal with it this time and i knew i want to color so i'm about to go and get me some breakfast because i'm going to be here all day last time i wasn't prepared at all i think i had ate a banana i had water and maybe one snack don't ask why i did that but this time I got a liter of water, about four or five snacks, and I'm about to get breakfast. So I should be good until they finish with my hair. So I will check in with y'all when I get to the hair salon and try to give y'all updates on how it's looking, what time I finish, because I have nothing else to do today. This is my whole day today, get my hair done. That's it. That's the only thing on my agenda is get my hair done. For the rest of my trip maintenance, the only thing left I have to do is finish packing my bag. I did my toiletry shopping yesterday. So the only thing I have to do is pack my bag, do my nails, my toes, get my eyebrows threaded probably Tuesday. I get my wax done Monday. So, yeah, 
we're almost done just a little more things to do i think i'm gonna look at my toiletry list again just to make sure i got everything i feel like i have everything but it's like sometimes you just never know so. all right you guys i'm rambling so i will check in with y'all when i get to the hair salon and keep y'all updated on how this process is going so we're not looking too good right now but later in the day it's gonna get so make sure you stay tuned either way this is um it's perfect venue Everybody's now the next day. I was at the hair salon from 8 a.m. to like 9.30 last night. I am pooped, but I am satisfied on how my hair turned out. The only thing I can like so that I don't like is the blonde. I don't know if it's like blonde hair in general, but it's shedding. <clears throat> I don't know if it's like the bundles but the bundles were already pre-cut so I'm like it shouldn't be the bundles maybe it's the braiding hair mix of it all together I have no idea but I have nothing planned today but to start packing my house is giving a tornado has ran through it so we gotta get this together. I leave in two days and I need my house to be clean and I need to start packing. So I think the first thing that I'm gonna do is start packing my toiletries, my accessories and my shoes and stuff because I wanna try my clothes on with my hair done to see like, okay, is it giving, is it not giving, you know, the vibes. So this is a lot of crap. I'm recontemplating life at the moment. But a good thing is we got us some Starbucks. I tried a new drink today. Don't know how I feel about it. I mean, it's okay. It's not like all that. But I needed some caffeine and I needed some boo. Because I don't... Okay, so I was going to cook this morning, but I'm like... You're gonna have leftovers and you're only gonna be here for two days so i'm like i don't need to unthaw my bacon and then have a whole fresh pack of bacon here for two days that doesn't make sense so yeah i went to starbucks to get me a drink and something to eat and then yeah i'm rambling i don't know what i'm talking about <sighs> let's get to it so when i went to target on friday i did not unpack a bag I left everything in the bags so this is going to be my first priority is to start packing my toiletries and I'm like trying to find like a place where I can set y'all at without exposing the filth in here it's very slim so I'm about to tidy up a little bit and then I'll get back on the camera when my place looks a little more suitable to be recording so BRB all right and just like that we're back so I have my toiletry bag that I found in my car I was looking for this so I don't know about y'all but I keep a spinning night bag in the trunk because you just never know you just never know so I think I am just going to get rid of all the stuff that's in here and just start fresh and I was gonna buy another one of these but look I don't need to buy one great boom so this is now cleared out oh so now it's time to stuff it I call myself the um, pharmacy lady because you got your Neosporin, your anti, your itch relief, you got your um, bacitracin, you got your cortisone. Because baby, we going to Mexico and 
you just never know. You just never know what you're going to run into or run up against. So I'd rather be prepared and not prepared because, baby, yeah. Let's see what else we got. Yeah, I found this the cutest anklet at the hair store. It's Hello Kitty. Y'all know I love Hello Kitty. I'm like, I should get it. And I got it. So, so excited. Gotta have your acid reducer. Liquid IVs, of course. Shout, we ain't old now, so I'm a little messy. And I just rather be prepared, you know? Because I was at the rodeo day party last weekend and for some odd reason i got ketchup on my white shirt and that would have came in handy so got your clorox your wet ones and your cottonelle wipes now that i got everything out the bag i'm about to just start packing this stuff up put it in my bag so i also have like these other organization totes that I'm gonna put everything else in that's not going into my torture bag but first we're gonna start with this because this is the main thing right now is the toiletries because can't go on vacation without your toiletries you just cannot so Brie has my toothbrush so I'm just gonna put an empty thing in here and then when I get with her I'll just grab my toothbrush so I'm about to just do this real quick and then I will tap in when I start to organize everything else. So just an update this is the stuff that I have packed so far my night clothes my fuzzy socks this is my hair bag toiletry bag I found this cute little case oh let me open this up from Shein 
to put like all my feminine products in because yeah just cute very secretive I mean even though I just thought this was cute I zipped this up later um this is another pouch I don't even know what's in these things at this point maybe I could just spin around and guess what it is I don't know oh this is my pouch full of wipes and stuff my first aid kit Trying to think what's in this one i have no idea i think it's my sunscreen and stuff another first aid kit i think this just has like band-aids and stuff in it this one has i don't know something in there is in here that i need um this has all my medications this has all my liquid ivs i got my two fans right here and what i realized that I forgot to get from Target was some like pocket Kleenex. I don't think I have any in here. So I'm gonna have to put that on the list to get um, as last minute stuff. So the next thing I need to tackle is the suitcase. Everything in here is just thrown in here basically. So the first thing I'm going to start with are my shoes. I'm just going to put my shoes in these protective sleeves. This bag right here has all of like my bracelets and stuff. Then I got my shower shoes in this bag. Then I found this cute little jewelry case on Shein. Um, these are anklets at the top. Some rings, some earrings. That's that. So yeah. This is my shoes, purses. I bought some house slippers. Um, these are two phone cases that I'm gonna take with me, silver and gold. Over here is all my clothes, bathing suits, etc. So yeah, this is the next thing I'm about to tackle. And I gotta try all this stuff on. So this part is gonna take a while. So yeah, I will, I guess, check in with you guys again just to give y'all an update on how it's coming but i know eventually i'm gonna stop and probably eat lunch so i don't know <sighs> all right so i am about to tackle my shoes I think that I need to get a piece of paper and write down all of the last minute items that I need to get. I know I said Kleenex tissue. And hopefully I have enough bags to put everything in. I'm trying to do my cube organization situation because it's just a little easier. And so hopefully I have enough packing cubes. I bought, I had some here at the house, but then I also bought another set, but it seems like the other set just came with pouches and not, and not a lot of cubes. So hopefully the ones I had here at the house will make do. I'll try to keep some Shein bags just in case I need to put anything in there, especially my white clothes because I don't want to get those dirty. So... sit down but okay let me just figure out this shoe situation and then I'm probably going to take a little break maybe get some lunch before I like tackle back into this because yeah this needs to be done today though not because tomorrow the only thing left well the only thing left I have to do as far as my maintenance is do my nails toes I get my wax done tomorrow and I'll probably do my eyebrows at the work. Then I'm done. As far as like lashes and everything, I'm just gonna bring my cluster lashes and I'll put those on when I get there because it's too hot to be wearing lashes right now. So when we go out to eat and stuff like that, I'll just put them on and probably just wear mascara throughout the day because oh, God, I'm not me. So 
Oh yeah, I forgot. I gotta pack my makeup. I'm not bringing a lot of makeup. Just some lip gloss, some skin tint, my eyebrow pencil, and some blush. That's it. I ain't bringing nothing else, babe, because it's too hot. I don't even wear makeup like that. But I just want to like, you know, just give a little oomph to the natural beauty. So I probably do skin tint, concealer, blush, my eyebrow pencil, and that's it. That's all it's gonna give because, yeah, I'm rambling again. So let me get up and get back to it.